were very fortunate that there was no fire sparks. Three people were hurt when a plane made a very hard landing late this afternoon near Oconto. Good evening, everyone. But the fire chief on the scene of that hard landing says it's just lucky that it wasn't a lot worse and, in fact, not tragic. The pilot coming in from Minnesota had radioed that he was having trouble. Ice apparently had covered his plane's wings. From there, as Fox 11's Laura Smith reports, it was all about trying to get the plane down and the five people on board on the ground safely. A twin-engine Cessna traveling from Rochester, Minnesota to Menominee, Michigan made a hard landing at the Ocano Airport. Around 3.30 Thursday, Ocano Fire Rescue crews rushed to the scene after learning the pilot had trouble because of the rain and snow. Plows cleared the runway just before the plane landed. They called us out at first just to help him identify the landing strip, and then he had some icing on his wings, it sounded like, and he had some trouble landing. And that's how he ended up where he is. The plane came down hard on its landing gear, breaking the gear and causing the plane to skid off the runway on its belly. The five people on the plane all survived. Three were hospitalized with minor injuries. It's still unclear whether the trip was for personal or business reasons. Authorities say the pilot did a good job preventing what could have been a worse situation. We were very fortunate that there was no fire sparks. The gentleman did an excellent job keeping it where he did and uh, making sure that everybody on his plane was able to walk away like they did. Shelly Rosenfeld is glad to hear that. She says she was shoveling snow when the plane flew over her house. She knew something wasn't right. I could hear the plane. Planes go by here all the time. And it just came in really low. And it was just really low and really loud. A couple minutes later, she heard sirens and saw the ambulances and fire trucks fly by. And I'm like, that plane went down. I know it did. The hard landing extensively damaged the plane. Fire and rescue units were on the scene for about two hours. In the town of Ocanto, Laura Smith, Fox 11 News. The airplane will remain at the airport overnight and will be examined tomorrow.